Oh god, please forgive us for the shitty quality. My camera died, so we had to use Sam's camera, and it is not nearly as good. Team Bro Pyre! Alright guys, anyways, uh, Sam wins the die roll, and uh, I think he opts to go first. But this is my side frames versus his, like, crazy, fun, Shadal deck, whatever. Um, I have another duel of side frames I haven't edited yet um, from last week, and it's uh, side frames versus Blue Eyes. It's going to be me versus Blake. Um, and that was pretty fun. Um, I'll go ahead and blow up his mathematician <laughs> with uh, with Gamma. I read it first um, earlier just to make sure that, you know, it didn't get its effect when it was blown up by a card effect. Um, I pot a do right here. I have the uh, card card D, and I, I decide to uh, risk the draw here because I don't think I had a side frame in hand or something. I can't remember um, exactly what my hand was. But right here, I'm just like, yeah, um, go ahead and activate, um, you know, the circuit, uh, draw two. And um, it's going to be Sam's turn now. And <laughs> I freaking gamma him again. The Armageddon Knight, too strong. And I get out um, Omega. And then I make Omega a card from his hand. And uh, that's the one thing people were like in arguments about. Is like, can I? Can you activate Omega like at any time? Uh, supposedly the ruling is like... You, you're, like supposedly the ruling is you have to wait till your opponent like does something on their turn and like but Omega says during either player's turn if you can max C at any time like why can't you like Omega at any time like people just fucking I don't know if, I don't know if that ruling is legit or if people you know um, are just angry about side frames I think it is legit but I, I don't know guys I'm just I'm, I'm done talking about it it's really stupid uh, we're playing we're playing how we play and that's just how it is so um you know because it's it's no hard feelings it's like team members it doesn't matter so um I just keep like Omega hit like I just keep activating Omega and I just Omega him to death basically um and um I he goes for the attack and I go ahead and overload him so um I get Omega back so now in game two um Sam opts to go first again um, he's gonna open up with, I think he opens up with Mathematician. Let's see what he does. Yep, Mathematician. And this time, uh, I have no response for the Mathematician, so that is going to go through. Um, he sends Mata, Mata to Beast, so he's gonna draw a card, but, I mean, is that, yeah, I think that's Beast. This, <laughs> this camera quality's so bad. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> and, um... Yeah, it looks like uh, he's just going to pass after that. He, he has nothing. Um, I pot of dew, and I add the Storming Mirror Force. Dew broke. Gosh, that, card's, that card is ridiculously good. Um, that card uh, that card can decide games, guys. It really can. <laughs> like, um, And I go, I go for Card Card D, and he Valors the Card Card D. So, I can, so right here, um, I just decide to uh, keep the Card Card D on the board. Um, for some reason, I don't remember what my hand situation was, but I decided to just keep the card card D on the board because I could have activated its effect and it wouldn't, I just wouldn't have drawn, uh, but it would have gone to the graveyard, which would, would leave me with no monsters to, you know, go ahead and, uh, um, you know, uh, be able to activate my side frames from my hand. But yeah, I just decided like just to leave it on the board. I mean, he has to kill it and, or, you know, let me draw two cards next turn. So it just, it just made sense. And, um, um, he, uh, summons out a window. I'm drawing off of the uh, the uh, Max E, and uh, he's using a Mathematician to swing over my card car, and then um, I'm deciding on the wind, uh, what I'm going to do. I think I might have a Beta in hand or something. Let's see what I have. I'm like talking about it. Oh my god, I was reading Winda. Maybe I'm going to overload it. Yeah, I overload it. That's right. That's right. I had to. I read Winda, and I was like, oh, like, cause I, I haven't seen Winda in so long. I had to be. I had to be sure it could be targeted and all, <laughs> all that. And I was like, oh, it's just, it just can't be destroyed by opponent's card effects. Okay. And um, yeah, right there, I overload him. Uh, so like, he activated Wonder Wand, so he can try to get some draw power, and I overload him. So um, <laughs> it's like a Wiz Wonder Wand, kind of just ate shit there. Um, and I, act, I activated uh, Psychic Path. I add two, um, you know, back from my Banished Pile to my hand. And um, let's see, uh, Sam is going to activate, what is that, Sinister Shadow Games? Yeah, it looks like Sinister Shadow Games. And then um, I'm going to activate, um, yeah, I think right here I'm going to activate Overload, to, like, so he doesn't get to flip one up. And he was like, whoa, 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 it targets a card? And I'm like, yeah, it doesn't have to be face up or face, I mean, it could be face up or face down. And he's like, oh, shit, okay. <laughs> That's basically what happened. <laughs> and then um, I activate, I negate his rota with my delta. Um, and yeah, I mean, the, the, my stuff's going to get banished in the end phase, though, because I don't have circuit, which kind of sucks. But um, 
Yeah, and then um, I'm activating um, overload my other overload to uh, banish his uh, face down card, and then um, yeah, because my I mean, my stuff was gonna get banished anyway, so it's really good. I just pass turn, he goes into Mata, and then um, yeah, I think I I think I let him swing with Mata. Yeah, I just take the damage. I'm like whatever. Um, set one card, pass. I think. Yep, swings with Mata. Um, I think I overload it. Yeah, I overloaded it. So it's it's gone. A pot of dew. Uh, what did I add off a of pot of dew? I think I want. I want to say I added a gamma or a beta off a of pot of dew. That's what it looked like to me. It's, it's really hard to tell with this really, <laughs> really shitty camera, you guys. I'm so sorry once again. Um, and this is, you know, turned out to be a, a better game than the last one because the last one was like a total blowout, like instantly. And um, he valers. He valered my card car again, like an asshole. <laughs> And then I activate um, Overload, and what I did this time is I activate Overload to banish my card card face down so that I could stop his moves. And um, I activate, he passes, and I just activate, um, you know, uh, Psychic Feel, Feel Zone and get out and uh, get out an Omega. And um, now I got an Omega on the board, so he's really, really screwed. And I'm just like, um, what's he decide? He's going to decide, he, oh, so he goes into uh, the uh, Sinister Shadow games. And he's going to send a hedgehog, hedgehog search, uh, what is that, searching dragon? Was that a dragon that he searched? And then um, I rolled for what I what I got with Omega. And um, let's see, he's activating, what's he activating? Uh, shit all fusion. And I'm just like waiting to draw because I chain max C, yep, I draw. And then um, storm, uh, the rippling mirror force, guys, rippling mirror force, so good. Shuffled in uh, the uh, no, he popped the rippling. Oh, he popped the rippling. I had to, I had to overload his his uh, Shikanaga. Sorry about that. Yeah, he sent Dragon. He sent Dragon and popped my rippling mirror force. Sorry. And then uh, he activated Raigeki and I chained, which was a really poor choice of his. Like he activated Raigeki, I chained Omega. That was a really poor choice. I, I think he was. I think he's just kind of not caring at this point. Uh, because he's like losing resources and I'm like gaining resources. I'm like, you know, right now he's like trying to build a wall with like glow up ball, but I have like alpha and I gotta search for circuit off of alpha and then I go ahead and synchro summon for Zeta and then um, on my standby phase, like uh, he's gonna pass turn yet by draw and then um, I get, I have Omega and Zeta on the board and this is gonna be game right here, I think. And yep, that is it. That is game. Um, so yeah, guys, um, side frames are really, really good. I mean, they don't get locked out too hard um, unless you know someone's playing, you know, like Prohibition or or Side Blocker, and then they call Driver. That really sucks. Or you know, I guess Imperial Iron Wall kind of sucks against the deck ish. Like it, it kind of sucks. But, um, yeah, guys, um, if you like this video, minus the shitty video quality, what I apologize for once again, um, go ahead and dick slap that like button and subscribe.